Hi, I'm Becky, and today I'm going to go over some more exercise ball exercises. Now, in my last video, I didn't do too much in the exercise ball exercises, and I watched some more videos, and basically, they fall in three categories. The push-up, sit-up, the crunches. Now, there's some added leg lifts and planks in there videos but a lot of these exercises like I said in my other exercise ball video I can do without exercise ball. Of course in my videos my ball is going to move around and my skin is going to stick to the yoga mat because after all I'm not in, in a professional studio. So I'm going to start with our exercise balls which I think might be good for you. So Get this ball, stop moving. Yeah, my ceiling fan on. Let me turn the ceiling fan off. Okay. Now, basically, it is the sit up, push up, and the crunch, crunches, yeah. Squats, that's it. Sit up, push up, squats. Okay, so one exercise we're going to do is we're going to get flat on our ball. Maybe if I stop sticking to it. And we're going to move our body upwards like this. So it's kind of like a crunch exercise. And just relax. I mean, you do these because I'm sure you don't want to sit here and watch me do 20. I'm not sure how many I'm on now, like five or whatever. And this is what exercise you can do. Yeah, my ball moves around under like professional videos. Okay, so this is your squat exercise. And then another exercise I saw in a video is where you put the ball to the wall on your back and then you crunch down. Leaning up against the wall. Well, I can't really do that because you can see I have a lot of digressions on my wall. So we'll just do our squats without leaning up against the wall. Hey, Misty. So we can do this exercise. Leaning up against the wall. Here we go. So there's that exercise. And then we're going to do. I don't know why. Where they call it like um, crunches and bridges, which is kind of like your sit ups. So, let's back here. Nice little bit of room. I know this program does not give me a lot of love. Okay. Feet up on the ball, and we're going to do what kind of your crunches, your sit ups, where we're going to move our feet towards you. So we're going to stretch out like so, and then move it towards you. So this is kind of like a, what call it? in between a squat and a crunch. So we can get more exciting here in a second. And you see my ball moves around on like professionals and then videos in the gym. Do this. And then when we come in, we're going to do a what they call it, a bridge where you lift up your tight behind you. Which I can't really do that well. Especially with this ball. Yeah. Professional videos look a lot better. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna move on to the but if you can lift up your high knee, maybe lay down. Yeah, this doesn't really help. But, you know, push into your sit ups, your feet in the air, which adds to your core strength, which you can do without the ball. And 
Another phrase that you can do, which you can also do without the ball, is like you lean on your back. back. I like to have my legs spread out, but if you want more butt shrinkage, you can put your feet together and you just lift up your tushy. As so. Flat, and then you just lift up your tushy. Which is right here. When you're not moving around. So there we go. And you can do this flat on your back without the ball. Which will look like this. This really is a good exercise for squeezing your butt muscles and make your butt shrink. And you'll stick your legs spread out and lift it up. And then we got our sit-ups. So yeah, my ball moving around. I like professional videos. So yeah, if I, it's gonna stick to everything. We do our sit-ups. Like so. Then we can do the combination sit-up and um, squat. So we like roll. Your ball forward like this. The Jason thing is not very easy on this ball. Yeah, combination sit up and crunch. Alright, that's all of those. And then we got leg lifts, which you can do without the ball. That's without the ball, our leg lifts are simply you know, like so. And do our dolphin kicks, which without the ball looks like so. That is your dolphin kick. So with the ball, Let's move. All right. All right. So we're gonna do our leg lifts. So we're gonna do these lift and lift the both legs at the same time, like so. Which is very much a dog kick. Which is kind of like your sit-ups. And then you can put your legs underneath here, hold yourself, and do your okay kicks this way. And I can help myself. Can you tell I'm not professional? Okay, this thing's constantly going on me. Okay. With your ball sticking to you, and you'll have a whole lot of work. Alright, so that's enough of that. And then you get your leg lifts. Which I saw in the video, which is pretty much up on your knee, laying on the ball, and just lift your leg like so. Which my ball moves on like professional videos at a gym, and my skin sticks. Lean. Maybe. And this side, and move. Uh. Alright, so now that. And you got your plank X 
exercise is. That is pretty much one exercise. You do like so, and then you up like so. Of course, they do a better plank holding themselves up. Of course, their ball doesn't move around as much as mine. I don't know how professionals get their balls not to move. Um, they deflate it or not. So yeah, there's your plank exercise. You can pretty much hold it forever until you can. Another plank exercise is combination sit up and plank. Put your hands on the back here. Put you very much. Put your feet up. Put your arms and a plank. And you do sit ups. And Exercise. And then another one I've seen in the video is where you put your ball up and then to the side. Then up to the side. Then up your chin. You kind of do this. Do the other. Or, as I would do it, put your ball up and then go from side to side. Which you can do. Without the ball, is why I don't like these stability ball exercises because I'm pretty much I'm doing this. Which I like to do it this way. Do your right this way, this will do your same motion. With that ball. Alright, and another one, which I think is like totally retarded, but I'll show it to you. I'm sorry, why I think it's so ridiculous. Alright, pretty much put your ball between your feet and you lift it and then you pass it to your hands. You're like this, which I don't know what. This is supposed to do it in between a leg lift and a crunch. I don't know what exactly is the point of this exercise. And then get a weight on my ankle and just do this. That's to do it without the ball, or I can do your both feet. Which is what I do in my dance video. It's warm up, but okay. Alright. Mm -hmm. I think. But another one I didn't show you is a sit up on here. Which they kind of do like this way. And here's another sit up. Of course, with this position, you do your bridges, and you do your pull-ups with this position too, which is like a crunch. If you're on the floor and sit up against the wall, or you put your feet together, you can. Uh, how these professionals do? Such easy exercises must deflate their balls or something. Alright. And the last one I think I'll teach you is with the leg lift from this position. I have to do that. And then lift your leg. This is your leg lift. You can have a crunch exercise. Or you can. Mount yourself, do both feet like we did both legs. Alright, so there's that exercise. So, check out my other videos. See you later. Bye.